Good morning, KVC. It's Wednesday morning, September 23rd, and I'm coming to you with a word in season. We're going to be looking at Proverbs 4, verses 20 through 23. And it says, My son, pay attention to what I say. Turn your ear to my words. Do not let them out of your sight. Keep them within your heart, for they are life to those who find them and health to one's whole body. Above all else, guard your heart, for it is the wellspring of life. So just some very practical things for us today as we go about our day and uh, going to work or wherever we're going and whatever we're doing. Uh, just some practical words. The first thing he says, my son, pay attention to what I say. I think those are words for us, is that we pay attention to what God has said. What does God's word say? Not what TV says, not what the news says, not what uh, social media says, but what does God's word say? We need to pay attention to what he says and turn our ears towards it. The idea there is to turn our head so we can hear even more clearly on what's being said. Do not let them out of your sight. Not only are we listening, not only are we paying attention, but we don't let God's word out of our sight. That's why David says, Thy word I have hid in my heart, that I might not sin against you. But hiding God's word in our, in our heart helps us not to sin against him, but it also helps us to pay attention to what God is saying in the day, maybe to your specific, specific situation or circumstance today. Pay attention to that. Don't let it out of your sight. Keep them within your heart. And then he says, they are life to those who find them and health to one's body. And then Proverbs 4.23 says, above all else, guard your heart because it's the wellspring of life. In other words, those things flow from us. If we don't guard our heart, if we open our heart to everything, every new fad, new thought, new pop psychology, um, our heart will be weakened, uh, will be wounded, will be led astray. And so he says, above all else, after everything else, guard your heart because it's a wellspring of life. The Bible says, out of the abundance of our heart, the mouth speaks. And it can speak either good things or bad things. It also says that out of our belly will flow rivers of living water. The Holy Spirit will rise up within us as we guard our heart, and He will lead us and guide us into all truth. So today, guard your heart, because it's the wellspring of life. Let's pray. Father, we thank you so much for your word and that we do want to pay attention. We want to turn our ear to hear clearly what you're saying. We want to see clearly and we want to guard our heart today. So Lord, help us, fill us, lead us as we make the right choices for your kingdom. We pray this in Jesus' name, amen.